Hi friends, this reflection is for the 13th Sunday of Ordinary Time. Try not to feel lucky or trixophobic. Anyway, so in the in the readings chosen for the 13th Sunday of Ordinary Time, if we have to look at it from a deeper sense, first of all, if we look at Matthew, we continue from where we left off with the Sermon on the Mound and also where Jesus commissions his apostles. Here, there's something very interesting that we encounter. And Jesus talks about taking up the cross. And that's the main duty of every Christian. Why? Why do we have to take up this cross like this? Nothing to it, you may say. Well, if everyone wants to understand the true definition of love, you can find it on this. You see, friends, Jesus lays down the work on what love is. You know, you hear, and I'm sure many of us, as, as every year you have this whole thing called Pride Month, and people seem to dismiss the true meaning of June, which is dedicated to the heart, sacred heart of Jesus, in which we place our trust in Him, in Him alone. Not the government, not some made-up God, not money, not our president, none of those world leaders. But in reality, Jesus died for us because he is love. Because God is love. Love is not love. Even St. Paul reminds us what love is in the, his letter to the Corinthians of being patient. It's not boastful, it's not envy. It's not jealous. Friends, love requires sacrifice. And sacrifice is shown through love. And I honestly think that many, many of us, myself included, is tired of people coming up with their own definition of love. Fulton Sheen reminds us that we must learn to love people and use things, not use people and love things. And I think in our society today, we have abandoned the true definition of love. And it's found on the cross. The cross is a school of love. Even the whole domestic home, the domestic church, where our beginnings, are, where our faith is planted, you know, we may go to church every given Sunday, and that's great. We may go to school and learn some things like math, reading, writing, arithmetic, and what have you. But there's one thing that we must never shy away from, and that is the cross. This is the definition of love, friends. And we must love each love one another, even our enemies. It will be hard for sure, but I think what we need to do is, it, is to take up, our first duty is to take up that cross, and we can understand what love is. God bless.